Well, the holidays are upon us, and if you're looking for gift ideas for that special Stones fan in your life, well, this is the video for you. We all have that one friend or family member who's just a little too cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs for the Stones. What do you get them for the holidays? Well, the good news is Stones fans are the easiest to shop for. There are so many things you can get, you can almost have too many ideas. Here are five tips to start you up. Well, the first tip is obviously the music itself. Now, I know today everyone is streaming and that's way more convenient, but once in a while, it's kind of nice to have something in your hands. And the Stones have put out so many different reissues and deluxe editions over the last few years. There's a bunch of stuff you can get. They've put out a Some Girls box set. They've also put out a fantastic deluxe set for the Tattoo You album. There's a CD box set and also a vinyl box set, which also has some pictures and just a great package all around. There are so many of these box sets that you have so much to choose from from over the years. Next up, Stones Apparel. As you know, the Stones tongue is like the bat signal for Stones fans. Anytime you see it, it's like, uh-oh, gotta get that. And there are so many things to get when it comes to apparel. There are, of course, shirts. You can never go wrong giving a Stones fan a shirt. Ask any Stones fan how many shirts they have with the tongue on it and they can't even count. So one more isn't gonna hurt. I'll always accept a Stones shirt and I always um, love wearing them. So um, that's an easy one to get. There are also a bunch of other crazy things you get like Stones socks, for example. Recently, the Stones and Skechers collaborated on a line of shoes that have their design on them. That's also been uh, very popular. You might not think it's a big deal, but trust me, Stones fans will accept anything with a tongue on it. Third tip for the nerdy Stones fan in your life, books. There are so many books about the Rolling Stones over the years. It's just countless. There are various formats. There are fantastic coffee table books that offer some great pictures. A lot of great picture books have been put out out there in the last few years. Autobiographies, Keith Richards' book, Life is a staple in any Stones library. Bill Wyman's book, there is just a slew of things out there to read about the Rolling Stones. If you just go on Amazon and put Rolling Stones book, there are so many things out there. I think any Stones fan would appreciate another book about the Stones. A live concert DVD or Blu-ray. The Stones have put out so many concerts over the last few years on DVD and Blu-ray that there are just so many to choose from and they're all fantastic. Most Stones fans love watching the Stones, especially uh, at home on their home theater system. And there are a bunch of cool titles out there they've released over the years. The Live at Hampton 1981 show, for example. The Totally Stripped box set is a, a must-have that has about four or five concerts from the 1995 tour that has a lot of rare songs, a lot of acoustic songs, a lot of club shows, which are more smaller theater shows that they had during that tour which had offered a lot of rare songs and great performances. is one of their best box sets ever. So that's an absolute must. They also put out a great concert from 1999, the No Security Tour. That's a very special one. Um, the show from Buenos Aires, 1998. There are so many to choose from, and you almost can't go wrong with any of them because these concerts were almost never before released. They've only released these concerts in the last... 15, 10 to 15 years or so. There's so many choices, and I think any Stones fan would not mind watching the Stones at home. So you can't go wrong with a live show on DVD or Blu-ray. And finally, my last tip, this is my favorite one because it's a bit more fun, something vintage. eBay is your friend. If you go there and just type in Rolling Stones vintage, you're going to see a bunch of original items that have been kept from, I don't know, the 70s, 80s, 90s, whatever, throughout all the years of stone stuff, be it shirts or posters or pictures or pins or buttons or dolls or toys or magazines. That's my one of my favorite things to, to get are old magazines that have the stones on the cover and I have a bunch of them. But anyway, there are tons of things to find on eBay. Also randomly, the stones and Lego collaborated on a huge Lego set of the stones tongue, which I've seen around and people have been very pleased with it. It's a very cool looking product and I think people would really like that. Okay, that about does it. Those are some of my ideas on what to get that special Stones fan in your life. Anyone have any other ideas for gifts for Stones fans? Well, put them in the comments below. I'm sure other fans would appreciate it. In the meantime, happy holidays.